Uh, I got a beautiful ring right here. I got my boy's pendant. Settled for this, but I really need this piece to work out because the client needs this by tomorrow. Oh, you know, it's just an epic shots. <laughs> Hey guys, Jasmine here. So today we actually finally got our embroidery machine repaired. It's been actually broken for the past like three weeks. So we haven't been able to kind of get that project rolling anymore, sadly. You know, we when we first got the embroidery machine, we got it like probably four to five months ago. Uh, we were like making a lot of things. You know, I've made some tote bags, I made we, uh, me and my brother, Gian, made some shirts, you know, we're making custom embroidery designs, stuff like that. And, you know, finally we're going to be able to do it again, so soon you guys will be seeing all the new updates on the embroidery machine. Other than that, today we also did our casting, and we finally casted our custom piece, one of the custom pieces that um, one of our customers slash friends has uh, wanted us to do. It's been very nice, you know, it turned out really well. I'm really excited. We did a beautiful ring of the Cloud Station and a beautiful pendant that um, they will be wearing now, you know, dedicated to the business. So I'm very happy to see that it worked out. So we were working on a custom project for the Cloud Station. Uh, shout out to my boy. And uh, yeah, we we're working on his ring and working on his pendant. I had a few pendants in there. Some of them came out nice, and unfortunately, the Cielo Mystic pendant, the one that I was really excited about, didn't come out that nice. I didn't calculate the metal properly, and we ended up with a big chunk of the piece missing. So, you know, back to the drawing board, gotta melt it down and continue to work. Right now, I'm melting down more metal so that I can do another flask, and uh, let's, let's cross our fingers and hope this one comes out nice. So for this but I really need this piece to work out because the client needs this by tomorrow and uh, he's going on vacation and I want to make sure that he has something special to uh, take with him you know after I'm done casting this piece we're gonna cut it polish it get it nice and ready for, for finishing and to we'll move from there and if all goes well the client will have it by tonight have to finish cutting and polishing and they got a little extra ring here for the cloud station so we're gonna walk you guys through the process of uh, us uh, cleaning this up and making it really pop out Finally using our embroidery machine, uh, which we finally got repaired today, as you guys saw. And we're going to be embroidering this really cool shirt with one of our designs that we made back a while ago, actually, of Archangel Michael. So first, we're going to use our C-size hoop because it fits our design well. We then cut our stabilizing fabric for the inside of the shirt. And once we place our fabric in our shirt, 
we place the hoop over it and center it exactly where we want the design to be. And then we slide our hoop in the embroidery machine and watch it do its work. So this is the end result of this really pretty design. Uh, much more coming soon. We're already working on bringing more designs. So stay tuned for all of that. Guys, check this out. This is the piece for the cloud station. My man, we put so much love, so much work, so much effort into this piece. Blood, sweat, and tears to make this baby come out and pop out for you. This piece really means a lot to us and I'm happy it's going to you. But yeah, guys, this is what we do. We took his logo, we made it into a pendant. In the back, it says Infinite Love Cielo. I had Sephiro come and made a custom veil, nice and oversized. We also uh, popped out and got two rings, one in size nine, one in size 10. Uh, thank you so much for everybody who helped get us where we are, for inspiring us to do what we do. Shout out to Trax and all my boys at Trax for being the inspiration of, uh, of this project and really helping making it come to life. And uh, thank you, Jose and Andre and my family. You guys put in the love and the effort to make this dream come true. And uh, thank you guys for being a part of this.